on everybody? I hope everyone is having an amazing day so far. The Miami Hurricanes are going into Raleigh, North Carolina Friday night to take on the 4-2 North Carolina State Wolfpack who are coming off of a devastating loss to the University of North Carolina. NC State will be without their starting quarterback, Devin Leary. He'll be out for the next couple months. The starting quarterback named by Coach Doran this week in practice, Bailey Hawkman. He was 14 out of 24 against UNC for 215 passing yards. He had one touchdown, one interception. He also has three touchdowns and four interceptions so far this season in action. As an offense, North Carolina is ranked 11th in the ACC for total offense, and they are ranked 12th in the ACC in rushing yards. They average 3.6 yards per carry. A running back to look out for is Zonovan Knight. He has a total of 406 rushing yards, and he averages 5.9 .9 yards per carry with three touchdowns. Another uh, running back to look out for as well, Ricky Person Jr., 4.6 yards per carry and 335 total rushing yards. Go-to receiver is Emeka Amezi, 23 receptions, 300 receiving yards, three touchdowns. Their defense, total passing yards is 12th best in the ACC. 265 uh, passing yards they allow per game. They're the 10th best team in the ACC um, when stopping the run, 4.3 yards per carry, and their defense allows 34.2 points per game. That is second to last in the ACC. Keys to this game, I repeat it every week, limit the penalties. Miami penalties, they average seven per, 71 yards per game in penalty yards. We have to lower that stat right now as a, so far in the second half of the season, Miami has given up 427 yards in penalties, 48 total penalties. We need to stop the momentum on offense for NC State, create turnovers, get to the quarterback. Key player to look out for is gonna be Quincy Roche. That is the identity of our defense getting to the quarterback and creating turnovers. If Miami can create turnovers, cause a pick, get recover fumbles, Miami should be successful in this game. The offense will put up points, I guarantee you. I'm not worried about that at all. Another key to this game is finally developing the run game. Last three games, Miami has not done a good job at all. Running the football, our leading rusher, First three games of the season, Cam Harris has not ran the football for over 50 rushing yards the past four games. We need to fix that moving forward, guys. My score prediction for this Friday night game, Miami is favored by 10 points according to ESPN. I have the Miami Hurricanes winning 30-24, to and they will move on to go 6-1 and one the rest of the way this season. And Manny Diaz will finally get over that bye week hump and finally get a win after the bye week. Hope everyone has a great rest of your day, and always, all about the you.